hiya, we've just moved out, so I just want to check everything's okay with the flat. Yeah, it's not, I'm afraid. What's wrong? Well, there were those marks on the wall. The scuffs by the door? No, the large penis and balls in the kitchen. They were there when we moved in? No, they weren't. On the day we moved in, I emailed you a picture of the marks. I didn't get that email. I sent you a WhatsApp video of the marks. I didn't have reception that day. I posted you a letter with a hard copy photograph of the marks. I don't open unsolicited mail. I hired a contemporary artist called Mark to recreate the marks in an exhibition at a nearby gallery called The Marks, which I invited you to the press night of. I didn't get invited to that exhibition. You messaged me saying thanks for inviting me to that exhibition. I found it very moving. On the subject of moving, you will be charged rent to the end of the month. It's June 2nd. It's in the 34-page tenancy agreement. You never sent me a copy of that. Well, yeah, because then you'd read it. That's illegal. What's illegal is the state you left the flat in. We hired a professional cleaner. Well, I had to hire a proper one, so that'll be another £500 knocked off your deposit. What cleaner are you using? The one true cleaner. Does she have mops of gold? And dustpans of glory, so you know her. How much of my deposit am I getting back? Just over half. For one cleaner? And the marks. Which were on the inventory. What's an inventory? You're a landlord! You're a shouting lady. I'm hanging up. I need to call my new landlord anyway. Hello? Hello. Yeah, just wanted to check you put my deposit in a deposit protection scheme. Yeah, I've given it to the one true cleaner. Why? So she can clean it. As in? Launder it, yeah, because I'm a criminal.